Well, it's a city that has always had a very proud football tradition. Strong roots here in Bielefeld. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is young boys facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a tight group, so it's vital these teams get off to a good start here. This should be a very competitive game tonight. starting 11 well they play with the diamond in midfield which makes the role of the holding midfield player so important is he there to dictate the play with his passing or be a defensive screen I'd hope he could do both jobs Here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Out of play it goes, and it will be a throw-in. Rustenberger. Making sure it didn't get past him. And he's fired over the corner. Well, that was never likely to trouble the keeper. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable. And we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, the game plan of the coach is to get the ball into the front players as quickly as possible. He is the player to do it. He's brilliant with his back to goal. We'll link up the play, and he's key to the way they play the game. A sloppy pass. Holland. Can they trouble the opposition this time? It's driven in low. It comes to nothing in the end. No space for them here. Good physical play. Holland. Kevin De Bruyne on to Holland and beating the defender Rodri and with that the attack fizzles out oh a lovely ball teammates in the middle 
Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Creative look about this. Jean Pierre and Sam. Oh, he saved it well. Walker. Silva. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Walker. Now with Silva. Oh, a good diving save. Going short. Very quick thinking there. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Rueg. Rustenberger. Cedric Itten. Teammates available. But really sticking to their task defensively. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled now, hold the ball. On, Stuart. They're in here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Rodri. Opportunity. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. And a long way out here. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. And over comes the corner. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, the opening goal of the night comes from Kevin De Bruyne. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So underway again here, one nil the score. And we will have just one additional minute. Rueg. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as complete a midfield player as you're likely to see, Kevin De Bruyne. Stuart, your assessment of his performance. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good, and he got better as the half wore on. It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Making sure it didn't get past him. Diving save. And a long way out here. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did.
And over comes the corner. He must struggle to get it away properly. Well, the opening goal of the night comes from Kevin De Bruyne. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Really doing a fine job of protecting the ball. Well, Manchester's... That's a foul and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. He'll take this on. Well, real quality all around. How about that free kick? And how about the save? Now sending it in. Good pressure high up the pitch. Bernardo Silva. Hold on. He's got it from the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. And the ball is moving again. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. And that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Able to get a body in the way. He may be. This attack looks highly promising. Garcia. And City have possession once more. Foden. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Manchester City have it back now. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Foden. And back with De Bruyne. Just not looking confident in possession. Holland. Holland. And a fantastic diving save. Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. Well, they've decided to make a change. It's a short corner. Bernardo Silva. And using his body to good effect. Yeah. 
favouring the short one Rodri De Bruyne and it's a double for him in this game no way for the opposition to contain him and no wonder he's off celebrating Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. The game continues then, and it's been all sitting. Grealish, Rodri, De Bruyne now, giving it a try, oh he couldn't outwit the keeper, another short corner here, and with that, the attack fizzles out. And a throw-in it's going to be. Well, as we get close to hearing the final whistle, Manchester City dominant, Manchester City excellent. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Mateo Kovacic, Rodri, Mateus Nunes, and the referee is going to add on three minutes. Holland, Holland. Well, it might still work out for them. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And they're making a change. And that is full time, really the worst possible start, you've got to say. Well, that's not the result they were looking for. It makes the next game really important now. They need to respond in that one. Well, many will regard him as the complete midfield player, Kevin De Bruyne. And how do you shackle him? It's well nigh impossible, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals. And a long way out here. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. And over comes the corner. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, the opening goal of the night comes from Kevin De Bruyne. He'll take this on. Well, real quality all around. How about that free kick? And how about the save? Bernardo Silva. Hold on. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Hold on. And a fantastic diving save. Stoppage in play. Rodri. De Bruyne. 
And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's on. De Bruyne now. Giving it a try. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper.